All right, all right, all right. Welcome back, my marksman to On Mark Gaming. Currently, we're binging through Paper Mario and the Origami King. Before we get started, a couple of reminders. If you like the content that you see here, let me know by leaving a like and commenting down below. Tell me what is your favorite part on this game so far. And lastly, if you haven't done so already, hit that little bell for notifications and subscribe to my channel because as soon as we are done with this game, we're going to be giving away a copy. And if you Hit that little bell and subscribe to my channel. You can make sure that you do not miss your chance on how you can win this game. Now, with that said, without further ado, let's begin. All right, so we left off. We had made our way into Peach's luxury boat that has been kind of like abandoned and ditched and just looks awful right now. Um, with the goal that we're trying to find something that a Bobby here clearly knows about to save Olivia. Because if, you if you're caught up with all my videos... You'll see that Livia is unfortunately suffering a terrible fate at the hands of her brother. Huh, this seems a bit fishy. Looks like someone made this hole on purpose. I would say that's probably consistent with all of the holes here. Oh no, we got some weird little spire things. Ah, I knew it. Folded soldiers were trying to get the drop on us. What are those? Um, yeah, we gotta put up our paper dukes, and we'll try our best to get them, but, like, what kind of Mario enemy is that? I don't know if I've ever seen those spiders before. Okay, so, um, we can bring those guys together. Do we want to do that right away, though? Or do we want to rotate them? No, I think we do want to do that. I don't know if we're going to be able to get them all together, but... It might be better than just leaving them. Um, that's going to be the best we can do. That's okay, at least we can stomp on these three or stomp on this line and hammer the other depending on how much damage it takes to kill them Ooh, okay so we got to do more hits than that okay so two stomps is what it takes that's not entirely bad should we try the hammer yeah let's see what the hammer can do I kind of feel like the hammer should be able to do more damage because they're bugs and we're like smashing them to death. Oh. He got the jump on us. Yeah, that should be all we need. Okay. Okay. Uh, we should be able to kill these guys now, I think, hopefully. Oh, no, 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 no. Alright, so we need to just focus on this line. Oh, it's okay, Bob, you did your best. Okay, well, at least we blocked one of them. Boom, cha. Oh, wait, there's another wave. Oh, no. Okay, so what if we push this line back like that and then we switch to this? Oh, no. No, 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 no. We messed up. Um, or did we? Yes, we messed up. It's okay. It's okay. We'll just focus on this line and then do the last line later. Go, Bobby, go! Um, we could 
do that. And then move there and there. Okay, so they did a lot more damage than I was kind of hoping, but not the end of the world, not the end of the world. Let's go ahead and repair this, and now we can pick up the remaining of those, and now we should be able to turn on the engine. Yes, there is an opening. Oh, but we haven't gotten the piece to do it yet. All right, so we got to find, I'm guessing, a crank to turn that. It's back here. Can I not get up that? What is this? I guess not. I can't really see well on my uh, TV screen as to what's going on there. It looks like the stairway is all broken up. That's okay. Okay. So we obviously can't do anything down there just yet. We have to find something else on the ship. So let's go ahead and head to the front of the boat. We've already cleared out a good chunk of this stuff. Okay, let's go back in here and go up the steps. Unless, did we come from these steps? I don't remember where we came from in our last video. Oh no! Whoa, I just stepped on something. Is it a toad? It is a toad. Oh, and he's like either dead or in the fetal position. Can we not do anything with him? I guess not. Let's check this first hour. I'm gonna guess that this is the control room. Yep. I'm a bomb bomb, not a bond bond. Ooh, we got lots of guys. Leave my little Bob alone. Okay, good. He got away from them. Alright, so let's move you in proper line first. And then just... Oh, no. I think we messed this one up too. Oh, well. Not a big deal. We'll kill the shy guys first. We should be able to stomp them out with one hit. And then we'll just hammer this group of three. I sure did like to climb on top of each other. Ooh, that did a lot of damage. Okay. We're gonna be able to do this in two moves. See, that's not gonna work. We can pull him in here and just bring him there, I guess. These guys are really strong. Come on, Bobby. I need your help a little bit more than that. Ooh, we might die. We 
we gotta do this in, is it say one move? Oh, we can just rotate them over like that. Okay, hopefully this will be strong enough to be able to kill them. And luckily we do have our green mushroom in case we're dead. Ah, we did it. Okay, so that's the crank to turn on the power. Yes, I have a feeling we know what it does. Ooh, look at our hot lady up on that board. We're a superstar. I have like a feeling that like Peach is actually a terrible person and that all these toads are here to serve her because she's so terrible. Okay, so we can't get in that door. I know we can turn on the power crank, but anything over here. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh right, this is the deck where, hey, Big M, how much do you know about us Bob-Oms? The life of a Bob-Om is pretty short, all things considered. That's why we try to make the most of the time we have. Well, yeah, it's because you're so explosive. I guess you'd understand better than most, Big M. You're risking your life to battle those folded soldiers. Ugh. Listen to me. Sorry for the big monologue. Let's keep searching. Well, what's with all the secrets? I want to know what happened to our Bobby. I wonder if his family got attacked. That'll be sad. Okay, well, it doesn't look like there's anything in the very front of the boat, so we might as well go ahead and go down the stairs and turn on the power. Which, luckily, we've already cleared out this area, and we don't have to deal with any more soldiers. Hopefully nothing crazy happens anymore, too, because we only have 19 health. Guess let's go ahead and save real quick. Yep, there is an opening fit for this lever, this crank. We did do it. Let's go ahead and turn it. Alright, so we got power back to the ship. Yes, the power's back. Great job, Big M. I knew you were the... We're to blah, blah, blah. Great job, Big M. I knew you were a take charge kind of guy. Huh? Get it? Because of the electricity? Oof, was I funnier when I had amnesia? Kind of. I hope this means the elevator's running again. Let's head back to the main hall to find out. Oh, yeah, we're trying to figure out what's going on with the elevator. Well, are we able to get back here? Doesn't look like our confetti's able to fix any of that. So, I don't think so. Oh, shake, shake. Yeah, that was a jolt. Get the heck off this ship. Ah, there we go. We made it this way. Woo, almost walked down that hole. Ah, cool. We got a heart. That's nice. <laughs> My 
Mario, it's a terrible. There was a crisis. There still is a crisis. I've been stuck in that whole time, so I don't really know the details, but crisis! Yeah, it sounds like there is a crisis, Toad. Let's see what we can solve. I want the confetti bag, though. Although, I don't really care all that much. We still have probably enough confetti. Oh, is that underwater? Why are we underwater? Are we underwater? Ugh, black goop. Oh no, we're definitely in trouble. Quick, big M. We gotta move. Yeah, I would agree. What the heck is with all this black gunk? And why would this ship set sail without Peach if this is Peach's ship? So confused. Alright, something tells me we're about to head into a boss battle. And there's a hole here apparently I missed. Alright, let's go ahead and save again real quick before things get way too crazy. We'll check the front of the ship, see if there's anything new with whatever creature there is, and it doesn't look like it, so we're probably good to go ahead and go. But the question is, is how do we get back? Is this all cleared? Oh, that got all cleared out. Well, hey, the thing was trying to help us. Whatever that thing was. Ooh, it's watching us. Oh my gosh, it's so much black gunk. My guess it's one of the squid creatures. Oh no, it's already here. That's the door to the VIP stateroom. Hurry, get inside. Yeah, but there's a block right here. I think we want to hit the block first. We got shiny iron boots, so maybe we're going to equip some weapons real quick before things get too crazy. I would like to equip the shiny iron boots and I would like to equip the flashy hammer. Sure. That works. Is there anything this way? It's all gunky. I see the VIP room, but we like to explore. We gotta see this toad. Go get a bath. We maybe should have ignored him. Wait, how can we do this in two moves? We could do it in like a few moves. But I don't think two. Yeah, I can't do it in two. We'll equip the shiny boots because these things are really strong. And hopefully this is enough to just squish them. It is not. But we can do enough damage now and kill them. Although we probably could have gotten away using our normal boots. Go, Bobby, go! Okay. Ah, that's right, they get behind us.
Ah, okay, so that gets us back to the front part of the ship. It was that spider that was holding it there. And you know what? I think I'm going to equip more shiny boots because we like to use that. And I want to use a mushroom. At least have almost full health because I have a feeling we're about ready to have a boss battle. Yellow box. Bob, are you evil? Tell me if you're evil. Do we want to take that? Is that more health? Oh, we used the mushroom when we didn't need it. Think, think. What is the code? Open it up, Bobby. Uh-oh. There's the squid. Hey, give that back! We have to get that box back. That monster is probably on the ship's bow. Let's chase after it. I agree. <laughs> I don't know why I wanted to hit him. Oh, I did forget to save. Thank you, Bobby. Let's save one more time. Now let's go fight us a squid. Let's go make calamari. No, it dragged it into the ocean. Gosh, this is giving me like flashbacks of the giant kraken in God of War. There it is. There's that awful gooper blooper that roughed me up. Oh, what a jerk. Let him have it, Big M. Olivia's counting on us. Woo. Okay, we can jump over that shockwave, which we need to. And then we're going to hit that sticker off. that bad oh but he's about to ink us so now it's gonna be a little bit harder to move around but still it'll be okay oh we got a lot going on There we go, that wasn't so bad. Now he's completely tentacle-less. Alright, what's your game? Do we just have to keep smacking your face? Let's see, what do we hit? Oh, we just hit him. Okay, so we gotta let him spin a whole bunch. If I remember correctly, I don't think we can hit while they're stizzy. Or I mean like while they're flashing like that. So they might have a little bit of invulnerability. Oh, we're getting hurt a lot. Oh, what's with the little white flag? Oh, it's a bunch of little toads. Let's bask in the dead gloriness, paper shreddedness of that Kraken. 
Yep, we walloped that thing. Alright, open up the box. What's inside? What is that? Now we'll be able to rescue Olivia. I have a feeling it's a detonator device, and I think he's going to detonate himself to blow it up. And guys, I'm going to be honest, if that's the case, I'm going to cry a little. I love Bobby. But we help them escape in lifeboats to preserve customer satisfaction. Yes. Speaking of, let's head back to the Sweet Paper Valley and rescue Olivia. Come on, Big M. Yeah, we rescued everybody, but at what cost? What are you going to do, Bobby? You're clearly going to blow yourself up. And if you're going to die, like, I don't want to let you go. Okay, well, at least all the little toads can enjoy some calamari. Mario! Toot toot! We need to rescue the passengers that abandoned ship, but there's too much fog out on the Great Sea. If you see that fog is lifted, will you come let us know, please? Toot toot! Alright, so we gotta rescue Olivia first before we're able to go any further into the Great Sea. So that means we gotta head back to port, and then we'll clear out the Yellow Ribbon, and then we'll head on our way to the Purple Ribbon. But just to make sure. Yeah, so there's the fog. We can't even get to it. Ooh, by pressing B, we can just return to the town. Guys, this is going to be so heartbreaking. I know what's going to happen. I have not looked it up, but that's just what I think it's going to happen. We're going to lose Bob. And be honest, I kind of like Bob more than I like Olivia. Does that make me a terrible person? Maybe, because Olivia's pretty cute. But look at Bobby. Oh, tell me about love. Am I missing any hearts anywhere? At this precise moment, the number of hearts that elude you is one. Dare to tempt the fickle fate and seek the lost love? Yeah. A Shogun mystery must be solved. The House of Riddles is involved. Ooh. Alright, so that's clearly what the giant prize is. If we were to be able to find all the toads in Shogun Studios, which we might do that eventually, that would give us a heart. Or at least that's my prediction. Alright, so we came from World 2, which means we need to head back there and then take the toad back to 3. Go to the Sweet Paper Valley and stat! Don't waste time, just go, go, go! Alright, we made it! Bob, it's been a pleasure. I'm gonna miss ya. I'm gonna be sad. But it's for the greater good. Us paper folk have to stick together. All right, here we are. We're totally detonating him. Big M, thanks for believing me and taking me to the Great Sea. Sorry I was so hush-hush about what happened on that boat and about the item in that lockbox. I'll tell you everything. Guys, this is going to be heartbreaking. Get ready. Get the tissues. 
A while back, I was traveling aboard the Princess Peach with my buds, my bomberades, my friends. We had all pitched in to share the VIP stateroom. Sure, some of us had to sleep on the floor, but the open sea, the salty breeze, it was the best trip ever. But then, that monstrous blooper attacked the ship. We did our best to defend the peach, but it was too strong. That's when it happened. Oh my gosh, all of his friends blew up. My fuse got knocked loose. It flew right off the boat, and so did I. Next thing I know, I'm in the Great Sea. Not sure what happened next, but I washed up at Toad Town. No fuse, no memories, no clue. So off I went, lost and alone, on a journey to try and remember, well, anything. That's where you and Olivia came in, and then those fireworks that we saw together at Shogun Studios, they made me remember. The fight with the blooper, my fuse, my buds, boom! Everything came back to me. I'm so glad my memories are back. I remember everything now, including a way to rescue Olivia. Bob, don't blow yourself up! See, I had a lot of buds, but I lost my bestest best bud a long time ago. He got scrapped in an accident. His name was also Bomb Om. Heh. <laughs> Olivia would have had such a hard time telling us apart. I always kept the fuse with me to remember him by until this amnesia hit. So it's just st sat where I left it, in that VIP stateroom on the ship. Big M. If I can save a friend like this, it means I finally become the sort of Bomb Om I always wanted to be. This is what every bomb om hopes for, a chance to change something for the better, to make an impact. Big M, I, I had so much fun traveling with you and Olivia. It's been a blast. Heh. <laughs> Sorry, I'm kind of nervous. Guys, I'm getting really bad chills. I'm going to cry. Thanks for the fuse, best bud. And thank you, Mario, for everything. Guys, it's not fair that a Paper Mario game is going to give me feels like that. And if you're not about to tear up with me, I question your humanity. Or more importantly, your bombanity. Bye, Bob. Well, what happened? Did you save me, Mario? Thank you so much. Getting flat and hurt a lot, but now I'm back to my folded and fancy free self. Wow, that whole rock is just gone. Blasted into confetti. How did it happen anyway? Did you get some kind of dynamite hammer or something? Just kapow or what? Wait, huh? Oh. Where's Bobby? Is he around? Don't tell me he missed all of this. Uh, Mario? Wait, did he? There was a loud bang and now the rock is gone. No, no. It can't be. Oh, Olivia, don't tarnish his memory by getting killed in the mine. Guys, I think what I'm going to do is just go ahead and leave it off there because that was really depressing and I think anything else to do in this video is just going to overshadow that fact. So if you like the content that you see here and if you're about to cry like I am, make sure you let me know down in the comments below and hit that like button and subscri subscribe to my channel by hitting that little bell for notifications so you can stay up to date on all my future uploads including any more depressing scenes from Paper Mario. Otherwise, guys, thanks for having, uh, hanging out with me for this hour. I'll see you in the next one. Have a good day. Bye!